riders rolling out for the race start. Always difficult at the start of the men's elite road race because it's such a long way, 258 kilometers today over these tough climbs. Now we're starting to see the evolution of this race into the next phase. Who is going to go on the attack? Taddy Pogaccia now at the front. Suddenly this race has bubbled up. Look at the way the French are escalating the pace now. Nance Peters is literally emptying the tanks now for Julian Alaphilippe. Two laps to go. France lead the peloton across the line. Taddy Pogaccia has got a problem. And Pogaccia is about to have a bike change. Total bike change for Taddy Pogaccia as he now gets onto another bike. This is a critical moment in the race. The pace into the bottom of that climb was relentless. The arrival then of Luca Metgetz as he brings Taddy Pogaccia forward. Pogaccia, the winner of the Tour de France, now second wheel, perfectly timed. The winner of the Tour de France starts the acceleration, goes forward. Pogaccia accelerates with 42 kilometers to go. Who is going to manage to close the gap? The Belgian team trying to bring him back slowly but surely. 11 seconds for the Tour de France winner, Taddy Pogaccia. Look at Pogaccia fly his way across this ridge. Belgium are hunting him down. 70 odd kilometers an hour downhill. Pogaccia is the solo leader of this world championship. He goes past our commentary box and he's got one lap to go. And here goes the attack of Tom de Moulin. Tom de Moulin now. The Giro d'Italia winner catches the Tour de France winner on the penultimate climb of the day. Get ready. This is the final climb of this UCI Road World Championships. Here goes Julian Alaphilippe. He launches. Alaphilippe now is going on a massive attack. This is the race on now for the gold medal. Alaphilippe going for victory flat out there we are that's confirmed it 11 and a half to go look at Alaphilippe revving it up as he goes over the top of this climb now he's getting himself onto the motor race circuit he's got to try and keep the legs turning and he can add a world title look at him struggling every single sinew of those legs trying to get more speed out of that bike not far from the finish line now for the Frenchman a passion filled attack on the top of the final climb Alaphilippe is going to win the world title France have a world champion he punches the air here goes the sprint for the medals. Wout wow, van Aert opens up the gas. Here she, Kwiatkowski. Who's going to get the silver? Who's going to get the bronze on the line? Van Aert and here she. I just want to to say thank you to all the all my teammates who really believe uh, on me today. Everybody did a, a great job. Already, sometimes I was uh, so so close, and uh, it was it's uh, just a dream day for me.